Hello again, welcome to today's attempt of a diffle puzzle. This is Wordle, but the length of the word is unknown. So I'm going to start with stare again. And we've learnt that there is an A and an E. The A comes before the E, but the E is not the last letter of the word. So there are still lots of options, clearly. So let's try something else. Oh, and we've just wrote out lots more consonants. That's not that helpful. How about we try more letters in one go? That leaping is probably more likely, so let's at least try that. Oh, okay, so we do have the LE. Oh, we knew that the A had to be before the E. That was a bit careless. Um, so it could still be, oh no, it can't be a plenty, but we have to use the a somewhere to the left of the LE. We can use the P in lots of different positions, but it's probably quite near the start of the word. So what does that tell us? Um, I don't know. The N is green, so that means it's after the LE, and the LE are connected, so they're consecutive in the word. What word has got L-E-N? Not necessarily consecutively. Because we're really running out of good letters, aren't we? I'm thinking A-L-E-N, but where does the P fit in? It's clearly not something like paleontology. <laughs> Even Something like biplane wouldn't work. Um, and the A does have to be to the left, so it can't be plenary or anything like that. We've ruled out the R anyway, but apart from that, there are other reasons. Interesting. I don't know what the end of this word is going to be. Uh, it's another one of those where I'm thinking for so long that my screen almost goes off. Uh, what are we going to do with this P? What are we going to do with the N? That is the problem. Well, I was going to try panel, but that's wrong for several reasons. We need the LE to be in that specific order consecutively. How about we temporarily forget the A just to learn a bit more information? Oh, okay, so the E and the N are not consecutive, but the N is the last letter of the word. because it's got that, it's, it's become a semicircle, basically. So it's P-O-L-E, it's, it's, it's something along those lines. Uh, sorry, along those lines. We've got A-P-O-L, E, and then the N is somewhere to the right, but not consecutively. So what comes between the E and the N? I don't know. What what can go between what I really don't know what goes before that N. What is the penultimate letter of this word? <sighs> M N? Something like a column with a silent N? It's obviously not specifically that word, but I'm struggling. Uh, 
I might just have to go for something completely wrong to get some more information. Let's go for apology because then I'll learn if there's an a Y. I'll learn if the A does come directly before the P O L. And I'll learn if the A is the first letter of the word, and it's not, but there is a duplicated O. So we've got something like that. We've got a letter, then A P O L E, then probably the O. Oh, it's just Napoleon, isn't it? That's a proper name. This game is difficult enough as it is. Oh, I'm going to have to delete the whole word to get rid of that typo. But this has got to be correct, hasn't it? There we go. That is my worst performance at this, I think, in my defence. Um, average letters, 24. Average words, 4. Yeah, so it was well above my average. It doesn't actually say if it was my worst, but not a great performance, but it's... I was not expecting a capitalised word, even though I think I might have had one of them before. So that's a bit careless, but it was a difficult one, in my defence. That's the Diffle Puzzle. Thank you for watching, and bye for now.